How excited are you, Ken, to be inducted into the California Hall of Fame? Well, I'm very excited for two reasons. Number one, it's an honor as a fighter. Number two, it shows that you were appreciated during your career. Being appreciated means a lot to anybody. Anybody, and especially the fighters, who once your career is over, sometimes you're forgotten. But now with this Hall of Fame, congratulations to me and to the other fighters. It's something that will live on in history. I still think the best fight you ever fought, even though you went on the losing side of this, but I disagreed, I scored it for you, but my vote doesn't count, was your battle with Larry Holmes. Well, Larry is a good person, it was a very good fight, but I thought I wanted to, but then again, I thought the reason that I didn't win was because it was fairly close and Don King was promoting Larry Holmes at the time. And Don King promoted the fight. So therefore, what happened happened. That fight was a real nail biter. I remember a lot of boxing fans on the edge of their seats because it all boiled down to the 15th and final round and the two of you really gave it to you all. I think we did, but then again, it shows that Larry was a true champion. It shows they had a heart. It also shows that in those days, we fought 10 to 15 hard rounds. 10 for normal, and for championships, we fought 15. And we didn't have time to rest. We fought 15 hard rounds. My, to my understanding, nowadays it's what, 12? And they're tired in 10. But then again, they get more money, so what the heck? How much do you feel going from 15 rounds to 12 rounds and championship fights affected the sport of boxing? I think it affected quite a bit because uh, 15 rounds, you train, you had to be in shape. Now they, they go 12 rounds and they get tired in nine and 10 rounds. But then again, I'm from the old school, so I'm gonna speak like my era was the best. I, I feel it was the best. I feel it was the most competitive. And, uh, but hey, nowadays they fight less rounds, they make more money, so God bless them. You had three competitive fights with Muhammad Ali. The first fight you clearly won. The other two were very were so close it could have gone either way. Did you ever regret that there was never a fourth fight with Ali? There was supposed to be a fourth fight once, but he chose to fight uh, my Leon Spinks, and he lost that one on purpose. And then they fought a rematch. Did you feel Ali threw the fight? He lost it on purpose. There's no way in the world, at that particular time of his life, even though he was slowing down, that a man who was just turning pro could beat him.